It's watermelon game, but with animal heads. Hello everybody, I'm Kindly Kian, and as you guys know, with any successful game, there is always a gold rush of ripoff games. And so, of course, Suica game or watermelon game being the massive hit that it is, there are a plethora of inspired games. So if I go into the Google Play Store, which is exactly what I've done, I, I typed in watermelon game, and here is just, uh, uh, there's, there's so many. But a few of them stood out to me, like watermelon game, cat. It's watermelon game, but with cats. Oh my gosh. Okay. Why does it say continue? I've never played the game. All right, let's just, whatever. How to play. I know how to play. Do I know how to play? Yeah, I know how to play. I understand the rule. Oh gosh. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How do I actually control this thing? I, it's just, I don't know. How, oh, okay. Where I tap is where it places the cat head. Now it does tell me what cat head is next. This is weird playing on a touch screen, first of all. I've I've only ever played cat game. <laughs> cat, I literally just called it cat game. I've only ever played watermelon game on the, the Switch. That's, that's how I play. So, uh, so playing it with a tablet, with a touch screen, with cats, is all very disorienting. What kind of cat do I have now? I don't know cats. I, I don't know like breeds of cats. I, I mean, I don't really know breeds of dogs either. People say stuff like, oh, I have a Burmese doodle. And I'm like, you just making up words now? You're making up words. I don't know what that is, but you can show me a picture. And if the dog is cute, I'll go, oh my goodness. Your dog is super cute. Okay, how far have I gotten here on the on the wheel of cats? We're like bottom left side of the circle. Okay, so we we haven't really gotten too far into the into the cat progression here. Oh, wait a second. So we're going to get the uh the black and white cat here if they merge. Yeah, there it is. That's a cute cat. Okay, you guys are gonna merge. Great, I'm doing it. <laughs> this is this is definitely feeling a lot more forgiving than Watermelon Game, I would say. Uh, at this point in in Watermelon Game, I would probably be in tears. Part of the problem that I'm having right now is that I don't fully understand the progression of the of the cat merges. With Watermelon Game, I know what the next fruit is in line. I, I can kind of visualize things that are happening. With this one, the cats aren't very distinct looking, I would say. Oh! That cat kind of looks like a raccoon to me. Or a dog. It looks like a dog. We've now made it to like 9 o'clock. If, if the circle of cats were an actual clock, it's... It's nine, oh, cat clock. This game appears to be a lot easier than Watermelon Game, which honestly is kind of welcomed because Watermelon Game has crushed my, my soul. <laughs> it's so brutal. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay. We're creating some, some cat avalanches here. Catalanches, as I like to say. I've never said that before. Un until this very moment. Although I do kind of like the idea that like we're facing the cats. So like their heads are bigger than their bodies. So their bodies are behind their heads. So there's actually a whole cat behind all these heads and they're just looking at us. That, okay, yeah, I like that. So th it's just, it's a, it's a dog pile. I'm not like using any kind of strategy here at all and it's kind of worked but also it hasn't because i haven't gotten beyond the gray cat which is kind of a bummer now i now i'm like disappointed in myself because i feel like we're gonna lose before i do something great and and 
I don't love that. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Now I'm, now I'm actually trying. Whoa! Oh! Ooh! Okay, okay, okay. Uh... Sure? I gotta... Yeah! No! Oh, I thought for sure we were gonna push the black and white cats together. Mess that one up. Oh, wait, wait, wait! There's still an opportunity! Yeah! Okay, wait! The gray cats. They're so close. They're so close! Come on, man. Alright. We can... We can work with this, right? There it is! We got a... The, that's a... Is that a tabby cat? It's like Garfield? Like I said, I know nothing about cat breeds, but I always associate tabby cats with Garfield. Oh! Come on! What? Yeah, there. Okay. We made that happen. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. I kind of messed that up. Oh, no. This is not good. I think this might be the end of our glorious cat run. Okay. Oh, all right. Sure. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no! Why would I do that? Wait, could I have... I could have gotten a, a watermelon! But it's not a watermelon. It's a... It's a... Cat. It's a mega cat. It's the mega cat. I... I had the opportunity. I just have to... Yeah. There it is! Yes! <sighs> cat achieved. I've made some mistakes. Oh, no. Yeah, that's the end, right? I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. I'm Kiwi. No, I'm not. I'm Kiwi. Okay, I'm Kiwi. 1057. Let's go. But let's just consider. What if we had more than just cats? Like, for instance, axolotls and and hamsters and and blowfish and, and capybaras? Wait, is that like, is that our end goal? Is the, the capybara? I love that. Okay, so we have a hamster. Okay, hamsters merge into axolotls. And then we have a, is this a Boston Terrier? Hold on. No, this is not a Boston Terrier. You guys will tell me in the comment section. I know, I know. A blowfish. Okay, so th obviously this game's a little different. Mainly, <laughs> the cat, dude. But mainly, the the difference here is that the the different animals are are very different shapes. Okay, we got we got two cats, so sad cats, and then sad cats become weird pig guy. I've seen this pig face before. It's attached to like a human body. We got hamster. Okay, we're going. We're going. Double pig. Okay. We got to get these pigs to merge. And they will merge into a doge. A straight up doge. Okay. 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 We got ourselves the doge. I love the way that he's looking like, did you just merge two anthropomorphic pigs together? And create me? Because that's why I think you did. I would love to get this axolotl. Nope. That's not going to happen. All right. We can do this though. There we go. Get a get a sad cat. Sad cat. Okay. Big mouth cat. Oh, what am I gonna do with a blowfish? Okay. We get another big mouth. No, we need we. Okay. Right. 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 See, this is a little confusing. I've confused myself. It happens from time to time. Actually, it happens all the time. Okay. The the two pig heads. I'd love for the two pig heads to to meet. I don't know if that's going to be possible. Maybe if I do one of those. Oh, okay. Okay. Sure. I believe. I believe this is the way. Mm. Okay. Okay. This is respectable. Great way of, of fooling myself into thinking that I'm a great gamer. Did you? No. Okay. All right. You go that way. Sure. Sure. Yes. No. No. You need to. No. The cats. The cats need the, the, the big mouth cat. What? Oh, what are you? I don't even know what that is. It's just a. It's just a, a ball of fluff with a face on it. We get ourselves a couple of those. 
sure. We got ourselves another doge. I would love if if you guys would, would merge. No? Okay. That's not going to happen. That Well, then I'll just take matters into my own hands. I will fix this. Okay. That's a lot of sad cats. A lot of sad cats going on here. Okay. Don't, don't overthink it. What if, like, my whole problem this whole time is that I have been overthinking and caring too much about Watermelon Game? And, in fact... These games that I'm playing, these these lovely watermelon-esque games, are actually harder than watermelon game. And uh, I've just been making watermelon game harder on myself because I'm trying so hard. That's maybe that's it. I'm trying too hard when I'm playing watermelon game because I wanna I wanna succeed. I want watermelons. When in reality, I should just be like. Whatever. Whatever happens, happens. That's life. I hate that, that those two doges are so close to each other. I'm hoping that maybe I can put some weight on top of the, the doge. There! Whoa! Welcome to the tank, black cat. I don't like the way you're looking at me, though. It kind of freaks me out. Like, you want to eat me. We did get the, the black cat, which is cool. What we did not get is the, is the capybara. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm do. If you give me an ad to watch, yeah. It's only kind of cheating, right? Oh, my gosh. All right. That feels unfair, but I'll be real with you. There's been many times where I wish I could have done that in Watermelon Game. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to give this another go game. I hope to not completely mess this up. Although I'm off to a pretty bad start if that's my goal. It, the thing is, is that like tapping the screen to drop the creatures is, is not as, um, there's not quite as much finesse as if you're using like the switch controller. That's, that's my lame excuse for why I'm so bad. Okay. And I'm going to milk it. All right. Sure. Okay. We got big mouth cat. I would love for that hamster to go over there. Oh, okay. Okay. We got a little fluff ball. Good. Can I get these cats to merge, man? I don't know if I can. I can get this going. Okay. Uh, Axolotl's not going to get in there. Oh, but what if I drop this here? Yeah. See, that's using physics. All right, science, baby. Sure. Okay. Sad cat to me feels like tangerine from Watermelon Game. That's where that's where I'm at with sad cat. I feel like sad cat is like the bridge between the the little guys and big guys, and I get a lot of them. But maybe that's just in this moment in time. No, don't go that way. All right, fine. You've done what you felt was best, and you've broken my heart. Okay. So I guess I, I see in the upper left-hand corner I can, I can like, initiate a shake, which I assume means that, like, all the stuff gets shuffled around and jumbled up so that you have an opportunity to get some, some matches that you otherwise might not get. That's not how I wanted that to play out. Oh, we almost lost it. You know what? Let's do a little shake. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was horrifying, honestly. But it did, it did kind of work. If only though, if only the fluff balls had merged, we would have had a capybara. We would have successfully beat the game, essentially. I could always do another shake. We could shake things up a bit. I don't... Okay. Okay, yeah, that's that's what I was kind of going for there. So we got the pig head. This is not... This is not looking good. It's getting a little cramped in here. Oh, that water... The watermelon. 
Uh, blowfish. Doge! Alright. Glad you're here. Oh my gosh! Why am I so invested in this now? Oh no. Oh no. Oh gosh. Okay, okay. Oh, there is nowhere for me to go. No! Revive. I have to. I have to, I have to keep this going. And we're gonna get a capybara. Ah! Ha -ha! Capybara is here. And he's adorable. I have finally lost. Sort of. I mean, I could revive, but let's accept our score. We got the capybara. And to me, that's a win. Even though I kind of cheated. And now we're heading over to Steam, where, of course, we have a lot. Fruit salad. Yummy, yummy. Anybody wiggle? What is this? A 3D watermelon game? It's not even out yet. My Suica? That... That literally came out today. Th this looks like Suica game. It's adorable. But they're like cat-shaped fruits. I love that. Oh, wait, no. It's not actually available for 11 more hours. Okay. Good to know. Look at this beauty. Watermelon game. They ain't even trying, and I kind of love it. Hand-drawn fruit. The attention to detail. You know we gotta try it. Okay, so we start with the the little grape. And we got strawberries. We got lemons. It's literally just giving me all the fruit in order. Up to oranges. Holy cow! Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. This game is like so bad it's good. Uh, that's where I'm at with this one. Also, it uses a very similar sort of path here for for fruits i guess the biggest difference is that you start with grapes but like not a bundle of grapes just one grape you get one grape but like the second half here like orange to apple to pear to pineapple to melon to watermelon of course is is basically the same as actual watermelon game but this is ridiculous We'll see how well we can do. Also, what is what is this? Oh, that's my high score on the left screen. Okay, I get it. Sort of. There's not really much to get. We could just drop. We could just drop straight up apples. We already got ourselves a pineapple. It's kind of surprising. <laughs> There's something really endearing about the fact that everything here looks like my four-year-old drew it. We got a lemon. Okay, turn that into an orange. Uh, here I go again, actually caring about what happens and, and considering my moves and thinking, like, what are the consequences? See that right there? I planned that. That was all planned. Incredible gameplay. Okay. Be cool, man. The strawberry over here. Cherries become strawberries. Okay, okay. See, I gotta remember that. Because that's a little different than actual watermelon game. Slight differences here, albeit minor. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I don't like that these apples are, are separated. I don't like this. This is upsetting for me. Okay, we have an orange coming up. Save me. You didn't save me, bro. You didn't save me at all. You've only broken my heart. More than I ever thought it could be broken. Oh, okay. Maybe. Maybe we can do something with this. I don't want an orange there. Oh, another apple? We got a pineapple? We got two pears. I don't know what to do. They're, okay. No, they're, this one is definitely feeling a little bit more... Um, in line with the way Suica game makes me feel, which is rage and delight, all at the same time. Like I've said before, Suica game, we have a very complicated relationship, I would say. Oh my gosh, that was awesome! See what I'm talking about? I was in, I was in despair there and then uh and then all that happened and now i'm absolutely delighted 
that all that happened. And and soon, very soon, I will be in despair yet again. Don't you worry. Despair will return. Okay. Double cherry all the way across the sky. Also, I don't... Oh, okay. I was going to say, I don't know where the actual top of the, the jar is. It's that red line. I know that we are very close to... To... Death. The end. The culmination. Oh, okay. I do love the way that, like, things just kind of cascade and merge together. It's lovely. Get a lemon over here. Sure. Get a lemon. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Oh! Watermelon! Let's go! I don't want to brag or anything, but uh, in all three of the ripoff games that we played today, <laughs> I managed to get the highest thing you can get. I'm, is that an incredible accomplishment? Some might say it is. Would I say that's an incredible accomplishment? Absolutely not. It, the, these games are, are definitely easier than actual watermelon game. But I'm still going to rejoice in my success. Oh, no. The pineapples. They are they are not being cool. All right. We can make do with that. Right? Yeah. Sh sure. This music, too. It's like so repetitive. That's it. That's the whole loop. You heard it all. You go over here. Sure. Yeah. Nice. And then no. Oh. Yeah. Oh. I was really hoping that we would get. Okay. 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 That was what I was looking for. That was beautiful. Now what do I do? I don't know. Just keep dropping fruit. Do what you do best. Dropping fruit. Ooh, ooh, they're getting, ooh, they're getting very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. I don't know about this. I think this run might be coming to an end. Wait, oh, th there's a timer? Oh, because, because, oh, I see. So if a fruit goes over that red line for an extended period of time, the game ends, which is a cool idea. I like that. It's a slight change to Suica game because Suica game is like, the fruit went out of the bowl. You're dead. You're done. You're, you're toasted. Game shuts off and erases all of your data. But this game gives you a chance to kind of, you know, work things out. I mean, I'll, it's only five seconds, but you have an opportunity. That was awesome. Honestly, I love watermelon game ripoffs. There, I said it.